mostly I just not being able to access any squash court's been a major change for me and I don't think I've ever been away from a squash court for this long. Also in the sense that how easily I've taken things for granted before the whole virus thing, for example, just going out um, and leaving home for a while, it's it's been a major change and it uh, hasn't been easy. I'm sure it's the same for everyone else. I don't think that's that much of a difference training-wise besides not being able to access the squash and play squash, obviously. Um, I've got a strength and conditioning trainer that's been fantastic. He's, he's set up a program which I can do in limited space um, and still be able to keep my fitness level high up. I don't have that much space at home but I just have enough to continue doing my ghosting sessions which helps keep me um, just keep myself used to squash specific movements and um, I've also been swinging my racket a lot while visualizing myself on court which kind of helps me just remember the feeling of playing squash mostly. As for my mental health, I've been doing a lot of yoga sessions online which has been great with keeping my mind healthy and overall I just believe that there's no point in um, worrying over things that we cannot control and for this moment it's best to continue staying safe and staying home to help all the frontliners and everyone working hard in order to um, keep the numbers down and hopefully we should get back to normal in the near future. Thank you.